Hi there, I'm back for another plan with me, this time planning for the month of June. Um, monthly plan with me's are my favorite just because the making the kids themselves takes the longest and I just find all of the kids that I make to be, they're, they're kind of like this kind of theme like cartoony um, and I just love it. So I'm going to show you the kits I'm going to be using uh, for this month. They're all from my shop. So the first one is my monthly kit. So my monthly kit is two pages. Uh, it's got the top headers, date covers, um, some half boxes, these ones for the holidays this month, these ones are blank, washi appointment boxes. Um, I've got some full boxes here, the side header, and these are all of the different headers you can put in the side box. Teardrops, flags, buildy stickers. Ooh, sorry. Next I have my notes section. Um, this goes right here on this page. Um, and I'll show you how to use it, but it's mostly a header and a lot of full boxes and things to go in that. And then my memory section, which I put right on this page. And it's just a giant sticker to cover it all, and then some deco you can, or not deco, get headers and the like you can use. So I don't, I've never said this in a video before, but the kits that I used to plan with are what I would label as my oops kits. Um, basically these are kits that when I was cutting them or printing them, I messed up in some way. And instead of throwing them away, or uh, some shops I know sell them, but I, I just don't feel comfortable with that. Those are the ones that I use, unless they're really rough. I've got some really rough ones that I just, nobody should be have to use those stickers. So I'm just going to show you some of the things that are wrong with this kit. Uh, so first of all, this is the deco for the kit. There's nothing wrong with it except for these clouds. You can't see them because they're white. I didn't actually fix it for the full kit because if I put any kind of border around it, even if you can't see it, I thought it was weird. Um, on this page... There's a little bit, um, when the boxes were cut, they were a little off, so you can see it here, and I'm just going to cut that off when I cut, or put the stickers down. Um, and you can see it in some places, like, these things here are fine, and the appointment boxes are fine, it's just like the washing in some of the boxes. I don't mind too much. Uh, and then in some areas it just cut too deep. Um... I haven't looked too closely at the second page, but yeah, there's nothing wrong with the second page. On the notes section, I think, is the more hilarious of my mistakes. When I was cutting it, I didn't notice I had some extra cut lines in there. So when it printed my header, it also, or cut my header, it also cut, like, the word notes out. I'm going to see if I can place the note, word notes down with the kit, but I don't mind too much. This one, the cutting was, I'd say, like, a millimeter off, but still a whoops kit. And there's actually nothing wrong with this memories kit, except for I dark or lighten this color up here on the actual one. So you won't, wouldn't usually be able to tell too much that it's a whoops kit, but this time around, I don't know, I just had so many issues. Okay, so I'm going to grab my scissors because I actually need them because of all of my mistakes. Um, so for these deco real quick, usually each one of these kits, because this is three kits, comes with this. So I'm a little lacking on decoration because I just didn't make enough for myself. But it'll be fine. I'm actually, this is my bookmark. I'm going to take this out. Ooh, that's still pretty rough. It's getting to that point where my planner is super full. Um, I'm going to put everything but my monthly stickers out of the way. So I'll start with the top header. This is one giant sticker. So I'm always terrified when I place this sticker down that I'll mess it up. I always line this t bottom left corner, but these stickers are uh, on matte paper that's removable, so if I place it down too crooked or too out of the box, I can lift them up usually without a problem. Just the bigger the stickers are, the more likely it is to uh, for me to accidentally pull up the paper underneath. Oh, okay, wow. Okay, so this sticker is everything I want it to be. That's amazing. So let's put down that other header. This isn't as big of a sticker because uh, the month starts right here on this date. Oh, no, no, no. Why? I don't know if you can see, but there's just this big bump. Yeah, there's no way you can't see that. There's a giant bump in my sticker. 
All right. Um, while I'm here, I'm going to put down my side header. Um, so I was looking at all my pre-planning for this month, and while I have a lot planned already, um, most of it's for my weekly sections. I don't usually put a lot on my monthlies, but even less for some reason this month. I don't have any birthdays. I don't really have any special events that are currently on planned. Oof, I don't know if you can tell. That is crooked. You're going to cooperate. Oh, I was really scared I'd ruin that sticker. So it's really nice to have large stickers because, you know, once they're down, they're down. Um, but it just it just makes it so much more frightening when I'm placing it because I don't want to ruin my entire... All right, I don't like doing this because I know it looks weird. I'm flipping this over, the planner over. So I don't like ruining an entire sticker. So this sidebar is going to look a little beat up, but that's okay because we're going to have a sticker down. Alright. That was rough. That was really rough. It's still a little crooked, but I'm too scared to lift it up again. I'm going to quickly look at May to see what headers I used. Because I really like the headers I used in May. Alright. Okay, so I used everything except for the to-do header. Um, I'm actually going to start with bills this time. I did it goals last time just because I really like this um, bills header. I actually put in all my bills. Um, I definitely put them like throughout the um, throughout here, but I actually like put them in here and it was a good mem like for me to remember. Remember. Wow. It was really good for me to remember to have it there. Oh God. I really like how sharp the... Uh, black headers look so the goals I don't put too much and I usually don't reach those goals they're just like really large overall goals for myself for the month this month is where I put like possible events that are coming up that I just don't know where to put them yet and then next month I always put a little bit of like exciting things coming up Ooh. all right I'm gonna start now with these um full box those half boxes I just noticed all of those holidays are on this side of it. So that makes it a little easier. I will need to bring out my scissors because this is where these cut a little weird. So let's start with the easiest one I can grab. Looks like that's gonna be Father's Day. So you see that cut, like grab like a piece of the other sticker. I'm just gonna cut that, yeah. Now it looks fine. So this is one of those that now that I've cut it, it looks fine. I'm pretty sure Flag Day is just gonna look all janky. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, this one in summer begins. It's just going to be rough. So I'm going to trim that a little here. And I'm going to do my best to make the other side match. That looks really bad. I'm so sorry. I'm apologizing for the sticker now. Just so you know. Flag day. Ooh. I'm so sorry, flag day. I just butchered your sticker. All right, now I'm gonna move on to the Summer Begins, which has the same issue. It already feels like summer, like wet, the temperature-wise. Summer Begins right here. And then my last one is Ramadan Ends. Um, I don't celebrate Ramadan, and I don't know anybody who does celebrate Ramadan, but it is a holiday listed in the Erin Condren, so I'm gonna cover this up. Looking great. Um, do I want to do my bills? So not all my bills have been like posted yet, just because I'm still filming this. It's May, but I am gonna write down the ones I do know. So I'll grab my bill due stickers. I've got one on the sixth, so I don't want to use blue for sure. I'll just go ahead and use this pink since I'm near it. The bill due on the 6th, and that's my, like, utilities bill. And then my Wi-Fi is due on the 12th, so I'll use a green one for that. Um, and I don't do any of, like, the automatic withdrawals from my account, just because, I, I don't know why, I just never did. So, I gotta actually remember this. And then on the 21st, I have a bill due. Uh, and that's my phone bill. 
that one isn't automatically deducted, but, or isn't automatically deducted either, but um, rather I have to go in there and make sure to pay it. All right, so far, so good. Let's stick down these payday flags. So I actually have to think this through. 26. So uh, there's like a new pol new policies for it. So I went paid on the 26th. So it's every other Friday after that. So it's be the 9th and the 23rd. Let's go ahead. Oh, I didn't even notice these paid. Oh, the payday ones are fine. The 9th. Twenty-third. I was kind of hoping it would have to work out that I have three paydays this month. Okay. Man, other than this one, this, this I like that. I was just gonna say this is coming before one of my bigger bills, because I know a lot of my bills are usually due right mid week, mid month. Um, so I do have one empty box here that I get to choose a full box for. I was originally gonna go with this one, but I just noticed how close these are in proximity, so I'm gonna go with these flowers. Ooh, let's hope that cut well. Sometimes I I don't always have oops kits for the month, like I was saying, and it comes, it's kind of a bummer when I do because I know I'll use them. Oh, that is cute. Okay, but I mean, the, the sticker was fine. I'll definitely need more from this one to mark bill dues. Sometimes, mm, I'm sorry, I'm trying to decide if I want to mark, usually I mark trash days, which is just every Wednesday. But I don't think I am going to, mostly because I just didn't pull my trash stickers. So I am just going to quickly put down all of these day covers. I'll probably fast forward through this part because this is pretty boring. And then I will move on to the two other sections for this month. Okay, so one of my concerns with these um, sun um, date covers is like how well it would cut, but they all came up really easily. There was no like ones that were stuck, um, so that's really nice. It sounds really sad, but those are all my plans for June so far. Um, I know I'll have some other stuff come up, but for now this is basically it. So I'm going to put aside my monthly stickers and pull out my note stickers. right over here so so this header as I was saying is going to be a bit of a nightmare um, that's why I'm turning this around because I accidentally cut out the words Ooh, look at that I'm gonna take out this T so I'm gonna see how it looks like without these God, that looks so bad. I'm so sorry. I feel like such a terrible sticker maker. I'm gonna just cover this. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to pull them out. I didn't even realize that that would show through. Oh, so this is going to be a terrible process. This one is not bad. I'm more worried about the smaller ones, like those inside things that I also cut. It's not going to be perfect, but it's going to be there. Um, and this is one of those mistakes that I will probably never, ever, ever, ever make again. Just because it makes it more of a pain for me. And you can see like all of these are a little just crooked because I'm just so frustrated with this. That one's too bad. I'm going to actually fix that. That's still somehow terrible. For someone who loves stickers this much, you'd think I'd be better at placing them. Alright. If you just kind of like only squint at it when you look at it, it doesn't look too bad. So I always put these two at the top. The two, I call them, I think half boxes is the best term for them. Um, so let's start with the green one. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. So 
So, um, I'm looking at it now. I placed the header on crooked. Basically, that means everything else is going to be crooked if I line it up with the header. So, I'm not going to do that. I am going to start from the bottom with this giant checkbox. I'm so sorry, green sticker. You deserve better than this. So, this giant checkbox is one of my favorite things. Um, what I'm going to do this week for it, or this month, I guess, that I do every month for the last few months is put that like a giant to-do list. This is mostly things that I have no idea which week I want to put them down as my to-dos, but one day they will need to be. So this is going to be blue, that will need to be green, blue's at the bottom. And I like all these like graphics I added to these large full boxes. They were a good idea. Sorry if you can hear me sniffling. I think I'm starting to get a cold, which is not very timely. Okay, wow. Uh, there's no way you can't tell how crooked this all is. I'm going to pull some washi in after I'm done to, like, fix that. But for now, it'll have to do. I'm going to put on my headers. So this one is obviously going to be my to-do one. I'm flipping back to see what I did. So, oh yeah, I definitely want one of these to be finances. Um, I actually used this a ton last month and it was very helpful. Um, I don't actually use this for expenses. I just use it for my income, you know, uh, Etsy versus my paydays, hours work to track that in there too. Um, what else did I use? Well, oh, I actually used the movies one pretty much, a lot more, a lot more than I thought I would. Uh, just like movies coming out in a, this month that I want to see. I'm going to trim this. Alright, and the last two. So one of these is definitely going to be my social media, but I usually put like a this month sticker, but I'm just going to put uh, this blue one and then right on the blue one. I have no idea what I want to do in that section yet. So usually I use that to track like Etsy stuff, but I'm not sure what to put it in. I think I'm just going to put it this month sticker and when I get to it, I will decide what to put in there. Um, I probably will use these checklists later, but other than that, I am done with my notes section. Other than that, I'm fixing this mess. All right, flipping this over, Ooh, got a little bit of a sticky there, to this section. So I am pulling out my last kit, which is my memory section. Um, this one is a pretty boring uh, part to watch. That's why I don't make my own plan with me just for like my memory section, just because it's two stickers I'm putting down. I never really know where to place this because the next one, and you can see the like quote box behind it a little. I don't mind too much. Not anymore. I used to mind a lot more and like put another like sticker behind it. So it'd be like a solid thing I'm laying it against. But once I put down like actual, my actual memories on it, like I put ticket stubs and sometimes I print pictures or like just things from the month, it covers up the back thing pretty well. Memories. Um, and this is the page where most of my deco will go. So what's left are a lot of these cute headers with words, one without words, and these. Well, I'll use them to be headers for my memories for that month. I use these to either hold in my specific things like ticket stubs or just as deco. But I don't do any of that until the month is over and I put everything and I lay it all together. This has been probably one of my boring, well, more boring plan with these because there's probably, there's not much I can put on these pages or the front one. I am going to pull out some pens to use to fill this out and be right back. So on this main, oopsies, on this main page, I'm going to be using uh, this pen. It, I just bought these new pens. Um, 
shoot, I didn't even look at what brand they're. They're Stabilo pens in 0.88. They're for fine liner pens. And this is like their blue color in this set I got. So I'm going to be using that on most of this. But over here, I know I've, this blue is not going to show up on... I'll try it on the blue header, but if it doesn't show up, I'm just going to use the black. So turn off the camera and I'm going to fill this all out. Okay, so I filled out everything I have for the monthly, which isn't a lot. Mostly filling in some bills um, here and in my sidebar, getting some goals and some things for this month and next month. Flip over to my notes page and fill out what I can. Okay, so for my notes section, this blue did end up appearing on this better than I thought it would. So what I've done is for my finances, I'm going to track how many hours I get scheduled for slash work each week. What I get on my paydays, the start and end of my savings. Miscellaneous income, which is usually Etsy, sometimes some other things. Uh, for social media, I'm tracking my the start and the end of my followers to see if I've grown any. And then to see how many posts I start with and end with, just for me to see how many posts I've posted that month. Just to gauge whether I'm posting too much, not enough, you know, that kind of thing. YouTube's, uh, YouTube, well, the tracking the views and the subscribers. I'm not as uh, serious about social media as many shops are just because this is less of a supplemental income, more of a hobby. And then up here, what I've decided to do is track which videos I post each month them for the month. So as I post them, I will just put them up here. I don't have a list of movies that are coming out that I want to see yet. So that's empty. Um, my memory section, I'm not putting down anything yet. It'll probably get a lot of deco and other things. But for now, this is it. Thank you so much for watching me. I'm sorry this was kind of a boring plan with me. I promise I will try to make them more interesting. I will link these kits below as well as a coupon code to use on them. Uh, this has got to be one of my favorite kits coming out in June. That is the weeklies and the monthlies just because this is so cute. If you have any questions or comments, just let me know. Um, and other than that, happy planning.